Hello, it's Chris with City Girl Homestead and Jack. And we are doing five requests, special requests this week. So we got a special request to do something meatless. So we are doing that today. We are going to make easy meatless taco salad. That sounds yummy. If we're going to go meatless, it might as well be yummy. All right, so I'm going to bring you back here. And I'm going to show you what we're going to do here. All right, the first thing we're going to do is I'm using regular Asks for Romaine, but all lettuce right now is very expensive, so we are going to use just the regular lettuce. Then we're going to need a whole can of drained corn and a whole can of um, black beans rinsed. Make sure you rinse them really good, you guys. Okay. Now, I don't have any more red onion. We, we dehydrated all of our red onion. So, I'm going to add some white onion to it. Here you go, Jack. And it says, one medium orange pepper. I used yellow. You guys, these were expensive. Crazy stupid. Then it says to use one medium red pepper. I just made a mess on the floor, Jack. Just for you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> now, I'm going to ad lib because you know that's what I'm good at. It didn't say tomatoes, but how can you have a taco salad without tomatoes? I mean, that just doesn't make any sense to me. <laughs> and then it says a half a cup of Mexican blend cheese. I need to cool them down too, Jack. That is up here, right? Yeah. So I'm going to assume that's just a little over a handful. Alright. There you go. I'm going to take my ring off. That means some serious business is going on. You guys like my new glass bowl? I got it from Little Dusty's. And I got Jack some new, um, Glass stuff, didn't I, Jax? And I got lots more to cook with. So we're going to mix this all together with our hands. Or you can use a spoon if you want to, but everybody knows I like to play with my food. And I think it gets mixed up better. Jack's over there doing the same thing, aren't you, Jack? Yeah. All righty. Now, Tom will not be home until later tonight, so we'll do a taste test as soon as this is done. All right, so once it's mixed, though, then you're going to make a dressing for it. Let me get all that stuff off my hands and move this to the side a little bit. All right, Jack, tear up my kitchen. See how Jack's trying to tear up my kitchen, everybody? I tell you. So I'm going to use my little Nutribullet, magic bullet, it says use a Nutribullet, but I have a magic bullet. I got a rich pain out. Okay. Um, and you're going to use three quarters of a cup of sour cream. Now it says to use light, I don't have light. Digging right in there. And get it. We'll clean that off. I thank all of you guys for, you know, telling me how you feel about certain things and whatever. I appreciate that a lot. What you think that I should do to improve this um, channel, everything else, it's great. So then we're going to use three quarters of a cup <coughs> of salsa. And you know what's funny? Me and my kids, we used to take sour cream and salsa and mix it together. And we'd go on my bed and we'd watch movies. So that was a long, long time ago. You'll have to get the other jar for yourself, Jack. Alrighty. 
then it says for a teaspoon of cumin. I'm just going to take a pinch and add it to it. Put this on there. And you want to make it nice and smooth. Alright, I'm going to shake this up a little bit so that it'll come off the bottom there. We don't want to waste our sour cream. camera we'll do Jack so that we can get it all put together. Alrighty. Now I'm gonna move this back over here. Now I'm gonna use a spoon. <laughs> and you pour that dressing over the entire thing. And mix it all together. Oh, that looks so good. Yep. Doesn't that look delightful? Yeah, it I like it because it's so colorful, too. I hope you guys can see inside the bowl. I'm trying to do the best of both worlds so that you can see us and how we're putting everything together. All right. You want to grab two little bowls, Jack? Little white ones. And then it calls for, it says it's optional, you can use lime juice. I'm not a big fan of lime juice. And it's optional too that you can use tortilla strips. So let's get Jack a little bowl of, of salad here. Put a couple of strips on there, Jack. I'll get you a fork. Then I'm going to take a little bowl. I'm going to do a couple strips. And then we're going to see how our meatless Monday came along. <laughs> you know, I went vegetarian for a long time. And I didn't mind it at all, actually. But... I do like my meat as well. So, let me show you what this looks like first. Isn't that beautiful? Alright, Jack, let's try this. <laughs> mm, I like that dressing. Mmm. Mmm-hmm. Well, I hope that helped whoever wanted the meatless Monday or a meatless dish. We decided to make it Monday because that's what everybody usually does. <laughs> so, I hope you enjoy it. Give it a try. It is yummy and that dressing is awesome. So, you guys have a very blessed night. Be a blessing to someone. And make sure you like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification button. Bye. You guys have a good night.